Now that I've showed you the what you get when you get Voss water or Smart water or even just cheap spring water, I'm going to show you the tap water in St. Louis and what happens when you pour it through this pitcher. And this is called the Well Blue Pitcher, by the way. I'm just going to get rid of this. Um, so I'm just going to remind you, first of all, of the tap water in St. Louis and just show you what it is by itself. So it's like a 9.4 and it's like a hundred, well, it's pretty, it's not as oxidizing as the others, 153 ORP and that's your oxidation reduction potential that the ORP. All right, well, now uh, this is filtered through at this point. I'm going to go ahead and pour some. And you can you can see that it went up to a 10.6 pH. And that's nice and alkalizing. And I want you to take a look at this number though. This is a negative 328, not positive. This is anti-oxidizing. And when you are sipping anti-oxidizing water all day long, you're getting antioxidants going into your blood vessels, into your heart, into your your bodily, uh, your capillaries, your cells, and and keeping them from getting damaged from free radicals, and that's all day long. Because basically, if with this with this picture, you can have it with you wherever you go. You can even put it in a tote bag and take it with you. You know, like to to work or where wherever. Now, I'm just going to show you one other thing just because this is a regular water ionizer back here. This is the one that I use with my family. And this is, the, the pitcher is limited. It will give you, it will filter, it, it takes about 15 minutes to filter the water. And it, one filter will will last about a month or two and and that's for one person so probably for two people it it lasts about a month I'd say and it, it but it is limited you can't pour water through it constantly all day long I sincerely doubt that you would share this with your entire family your extended family etc just this picture because it loses its potency if you the more you pour but a water ionizer and please click on the link below this video because I'm going to also show you how I have payment plans and really the water ionizer is actually cheaper than even the portable 11.1 .1 pH so it's, it's very nicely alkalizing it's going to help your cells get rid of their acids by by providing yourself with alkalizing water all day long but I want you to take a look at this that's a negative 815 and you are able to get that antioxidant all day long one other thing with with either the water from the pitcher or from the ionizer, what about people who go to work? Obvi you know, I mean, obviously you could take the pitcher to work with you, um, but you have to have a water source. You have to have water to put in the pitcher and then 15 minutes to let it pour through and mm, this type of thing. Actually, you could just with the ionized water, with a regular ionizer, you could fill up your water bottles. Now these are vacuum sealed water bottles. They they fill up to a lip inside and then you stick this lid on 
and it actually seals the antioxidants in. So for the most part, most water bottles will not preserve the pH and the ORP of your ionized water. So you, you pour it and it has great results like I just showed you, but then halfway through the day, it's dropped to, you know, much, much, you know, way down. So uh, the way to preserve it is this type of thing. I've got other blog posts about the the uh, vacuum bottles. I also have blog posts showing you how to get inexpensive, you just use inexpensive mason jars. But these vacuum bottles are attractive and you can take them anywhere. You just throw them in your purse and drink right, you know, as you go through the day. You can have a tote bag with four or five of these vacuum bottles and uh, <clears throat> just, uh, you know, you just open them up when you're ready to drink. So there are a lot of options for convenience and a lot of options for for inexpensiveness of the water ionizers please click on the link below this video so that you can see the entire blog post because I'm going to show you the dollar and cents and show you uh, how anybody that can anybody who can afford to pay 50 cents for a gallon of water at Walmart can afford this. Another thing about, uh, well this picture is wonderful, even if you buy a water ionizer you should also get this picture because you can take it with you. Let's say you were going in the airport on a trip or you were going and you know just somewhere where you obviously cannot take your water ionizer you can take this. So it is a no-brainer that you can take this if you're not using it every day, you can just take that filter, unscrew it, and stick it in a baggie, stick it in the refrigerator, and it'll be good to go the next time that you want to use it. So it's, even if you have a water ionizer, you should get yourself a pitcher for those situations. But the water ionizer itself is something that people who we were mentioning in the other video um, you know, people who buy bottled water are often concerned about microorganisms in the water. Well, this particular ionizer has two filter ports. You can put a .01 filter in one side of this. You can put the very high quality BioStone Plus filter in the other port and you'll be getting, with the .01 filter, getting rid of any possibility of microorganisms or fungus or you know E. coli and anything and then on the other filter port you'll be getting rid of fluoride, chloramine, lead, uh, any heavy metals, other chemicals, you name it and you'll be getting very very clean water and also as I just showed you alkalizing water and antioxidizing water. So remember to click on that link below to see how inexpensive it is for you to do that. Okay? Thanks.